In this video, I'd like to share what I've learned from watching instructional videos on YouTube for delayed sweep. I have a Tech 2465A that has uh, a gated waveform. Uh, basically, what it is, it's an 80 kilohertz sine wave that's gated by a 2 kilohertz square wave. Uh, it's shown in the top and bottom, channel 1, channel 2, respectively. And um, we initiate the delayed sweep for this particular tech model by pulling on the um, sweep knob. And you now see the B indicator come on. And um, you'll see a highlight on the waveform. It's basically an intensified uh, portion of the waveform. And you initiate the delayed sweep by turning on this knob clockwise and it starts out with a uh, wider highlight and as you can see in the bottom you now have a magnification of that portion that's highlighted you wanna in this case I wanted to uh, narrow it down so I keep turning it clockwise to incre increase the uh, sweep speed and as you can see um, we now have a magnification of that portion and I can choose which portion of the waveform gets highlighted by turning on the delta reference knob but uh, what I really wanted to show in this video is um, how for this particular model I can highlight both the falling edge in this case for channel 1 and 2 and the rising edge for channel 1 and 2 simultaneously and I found out I could do that by um, setting the uh, AB trigger to B set at run after delay and um, en enabling the uh, Delta T button now in this case uh, you will notice that the highlight is now independent um, you got a highlight for the falling edge of channel 1 and you got a highlight on the rising edge for channel 2 and you can turn the delta knobs independently of each other now I could but what I really want is uh, be able to highlight the falling edge and the rising edge simultaneously um, simultaneously and independently with each of these knobs and I found out that I could do that by pressing the uh, alternate button and um, which now enables me to independently um, highlight the falling and the rising edges and I could uh, further view that as you can see they're now um, overlapping each other I could view that further for, for further examination by pressing the um, the sweep knob back down to just show the B sweep and now in this case I'm able to um, independently view the um, falling edges for channel 1 and the rising edges for channel 1 Thanks very much.